In this video, I'm going to talk about angles. Uh, actually, I'm going to talk about adjacent angles because I've had a lot of people that have been reviewing a lot of my proofs lately, and they're sitting there going, I don't know what the heck he's talking about. All right. Now, as I mentioned in a previous video, when you have an angle here, you're going to have two rays. A, B is ray number one, and B, D is ray number two. Two rays that meet at a point like this become an angle. Now, what are adjacent angles? Well, first of all, we have an angle A, B, D. That's one angle. Then we have another angle D, B, C. Now, two angles that come together and share a side are adjacent angles. Well, certainly these two angles are together. They share a common side. So A, B, D and D, B, C are adjacent angles. One more time. These two angles are put together. They share a common side. And that makes them adjacent angles. Now, Usually adjacent angles, I can't imagine anywhere where they wouldn't be, but usually adjacent angles total 180 degrees. All right. Let's say hypothetically this was 90 degrees and this was, hypo this was hypothetically 90 degrees. Now, obviously they're not, but let's go hypothetical for a second. 90 degrees in one angle plus 90 degrees in another angle comes up with 180 degrees. Now, more realistically, let's say that this was 95 degrees and this was 85 degrees. Well, 95 degrees plus 85 degrees comes up with 180 degrees. So, adjacent angles should, and I can't imagine any place where they wouldn't be, but they should add up to 180 degrees. And that's what adjacent angles are. Alright, I will tell you more in a future video, so stay tuned.